Now, here's your two-minute take on area businesses, communities, events, and entertainment. Good morning, I'm Jim Hall with a two-minute take presented by the Cadillac Foundation. And today we're coming to you from the Cadillac Healthplex in Richland, visiting with Karen Hayes, who is the manager of community health programs here at Cadillac. And Karen, we're here in the resource library at the Healthplex, but the programs that you offer and that are offered to the community are that and a lot more, aren't they? The resource library is such a great place to come if you are living with a chronic health condition or caregiving for someone who is. You can come in and share your experience and what you're uh, going through and the staff here can help you uh, find library resources as well as connect you with support groups and educational programs to help. And it's such a wonderful program, the breadth of them. You mentioned support groups. I know a variety of different uh, diseases and, and instances that people can access to help them, right? Absolutely. We have a lot of resources for Alzheimer's and dementia, for a variety of neurological disorders. We have a support group for pulmonary disorders and many uh, support groups for caregiving. And then you touched on some of the community health programs throughout the year. These are uh, I know one key prod, uh, area of focus right now is in the mental health arena. Talk a little bit about the importance of those. Right, we are offering mental health first aid and also some suicide awareness and prevention programs, which are really key to um, addressing mental health and helping to reduce the incidence of suicide. Important stuff right here at the Cadillac Healthplex with Karen Hayes and her team with Cadillac's Community Health Programs. If you'd like to access any of the services, learn more about the latest available here at Cadillac, you can visit cadillac.org/knrc. Our thanks to Karen and thank you for watching the Two Minute Take.